What is up guys, Toby here, welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Ultra Sun Wonderlock. Last time we took on the Water Trial, um, for a bit, bit high level. So it, it was really cool, but also like, not a challenge, because I was led astray. Uh, we're gonna put Eden up front. Because he is our lowest, or she is our lowest level. And we're actually recording, uh, in the day, for once. <laughs> So we actually have the sun out, um, but it, oh actually, now that I think about it, hello Marie, the one Pokemon Center, because the, the plan is of course to go down south past the Sudowoodo, but the one Pokemon Center said there was a secret to like some flower pot, I'm pretty sure it was the Pokemon Center up here by Brooklet Hill, um, so let's, Let's stop there real quick, and see if anything really happens. Do you know there's a secret about flower? Uh, I'm interested. You see the flowers. Comfey floated some flowers on the water. As you saw, they belong to Comfey. They have a healing effect, so they're great to have at a Pokemon Center. It always brings flowers in the morning to help heal everyone who comes here. That's yes, cool. Comfey is so caring, it uses floral healing the moment any Pokemon are near, just in case. Oh, come on, Comfey. Just because your ability is, <laughs> is triage, however you want to say that, doesn't mean you can go ahead and heal other people's Pokemon. That's my job. <laughs> Okay, well, that was pretty cool. Okay. Worth it. Worth, definitely worth coming over here to check that out. Alright, well, let's go uh, terrorize some poor Sudowoodo. He didn't deserve this man. Down here. Looks so like you pass, you yeah, have Walterium Z. Wait, 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 wait. Aha! Heal ball. Okay, I was like, there's a little, little nook over there. He's poor Sudo running away. PTSD. Hello. Wait, those are Pokemon. I totally thought they were just plants. Calm yourself, Zosi. Uh, those must have been the Pokemon known as Sudo the most interesting Pokemon. I wish I could research them further. They must be mimicking plant life in an attempt to avoid their weakness, water. These lowland Pokemon, they're all so unique, it's truly fascinating, but battling them is not easy. So I challenge you with one we are accustomed to. The okay, I want you to know, this Mon, right? I look, like, out of all the leaks prior to the game coming out, this is the one I looked up. Because I wanted to know its name. Because he's adorable. And his name is the best name I have ever, like, Pokemon has ever made. I fucking love, like, no nickname needed. It's Poiple. It's fucking Poiple. I knew it, you can't just challenge people like that. Sorry, Mr. Trainer, but do you think a battle would be okay? Yeah. Yeah, show me the Poiple. I will warn you now, Poiple cannot be found anywhere in Alola. You give it, though. I need it. Boy, do I need it. Look at Poiple. If you don't know who Poiple is, you're about to find out. That's for damn sure. Poiple is this little guy. He evolves, but I don't. I don't want him to evolve. He's he's kind of on the list as with Chargebuggins feel for me. He gets to remain like that forever, because his and no nickname. Poiple is all you need. Oh, I love it. I love it. I'm sorry, I gotta put you down though. X defense. Interesting. Pretty sure I'd still kill you, though. Oh! You were n Okay, so... It's not a Dragon-type. So Dragon-type when it evolves. But currently it is not. So Sand Tomb? This is UB Adhesive. There we go. Alright. Charm. Alright. God, I want it. I want... You can, you can best believe 
I'm making free for all people. You already know. Okay, it should be low enough. Dragon Rage to just do the trick. There we go. Eden hit level 25. So I felt uh, to understand Poipo. Yeah. You, you gotta you gotta know the hidden tech of Poipo. I must research my reason for my defeat. Your Z powering. It's so pretty when it shines like that. What are you suggesting? That it might be like the beautiful light our ancestors once saw? How should I know? See you around, trainer. Okay, interesting, interesting. The Voidful! So happy. Alright, so new route, new encounter. Route say, uh... Oh! You're a double battle. Captain Galway is teaching them how to dance, okay. I'm like, whoa, just exercising outside, sure, dancing family. Okay, Jigglypuff and Igglybuff. Oh, uh, that's a fairy. Oh, those are both fairies. Eden, Eden no like. Eden no like. Um, let's go out into the Edelweiss and charge beam the Jigglypuff. I'm not too worried about the Igglybuff. Hypnosis, or rather Sing, might be annoying, but we'll see. We we'll probably both have it. Eve got the boost, disarming voice, yeah. And pound, okay, we good. We good. Go for a bubble, because it hits both. And then a charge beam on the Igly buff. Because we'll outspeed, at plus one. I'm thinking that's, yeah, that's death, and then the bubble, <laughs> plus two. And then the bubble will finish the job. Right? Yeah. Okay. Well, that was a, that's definitely a new double battle team. Like, trainer class name and everything. Family dancers. Another goddamn revive, okay. Well, I know we want to go- oh. You weren't even on my screen, dude! Goddamn! Okay, you got two months. What you got? A bounce sweep. Okay. So I was just shown what bounce sweep is based off of, like the fruit. And they're just cursed plums. Like, don't open those. <laughs> the insides look disgusting. I don't know what it's called. But it's a fruit in Pikmin 3. And I was shown, like, the... Like, real-world equivalent, like, cut it, cut in half and whatnot. Yeah, nah, they're cursed. Don't fuck with those. Mareep. Uh... Is Sand Tomb gonna be enough? I mean, super effective... But it's sand. Okay, yeah, I was like, but it's sand tomb. So I fully expect things to live it. But I guess not. Okay. Okay, no encounter yet. I wanted to just go over here because there are items back here. A super repel, okay. And the TM4 sleep talk. Alright. I remember the TM being back here. But it's just sleep talk. Oh, can't get through there. Okay, our Route 6 encounter. What do we got? Okay. I'm pretty, pretty keen on throwing Eevee at people. They don't feel as bad, you know? Uh, do you have 40 HP? That's the question. Like, part of me wants a Dragon Rage. But... I don't know if it would... Well, let me open Showdown. Let me, let me see. Call for help. God damn it. So if we make... No friends. Poor Eevee. Make a level 15 Eevee. It has... With... 
zero EVs and had zero IVs, it would still have 41 HP at level 15. Zero EVs, zero IVs. So it should live, worst case scenario, it should live on one. Showdown coming through. Look at that! Do you have friends now? Yeah. That one higher level, so it'll definitely live this Dragon Rage. Sand is... <sighs> Wait, does, doesn't Dragon Rage not check accuracy? I don't know if that was just luck or if I was correct in thinking that. Either way. We got like a 1 HP Eevee over here. Let's go ahead. Try and use up these Pokeballs. We definitely are in territory where we need to start using Great Balls, but we have so many Pokeballs left over. I, uh, I just want to get it done and over with, you know? Come on. Come on, Eevee. Okay. Guess where you... Well, we do have Ultra Balls. I don't know Eevee's catch rate. And I'm pretty annoyed. <laughs> so... There we go. All right. Nice Eevee for some random soul on one to trade. No nickname. And out the box. Okay. Oh no. Not you. I thought I smelled something. You there, trainer. Can you come to my aid? Over here. Yo, 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 don't go cur turn your backside on us, and you, you're the numbskull trainer from, from Mele Mele, yo. These scoundrels are Pokemon thieves, and you're on familiar terms with them? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's right, you do. I'm Hapu, uh, I know. Life in the big city, sure is something else. Pokemon thieves roam about brazenly. Hmm, I leave that one to you. We're not thieves, yo, it's a legitimate business. We got strange messed up. We are straight messed up in Mele Mele. Got exiles of a color. We ain't going out like that. <sighs> I forgot she existed. Alright, what you got? Dr are you drowsy or Zubat? You are drowsy, okay. What level? 17. Hit up with the dual chop. Gone. <laughs> Moving on. With all these losses, we're gonna anger our bosses. These tears taste like salt, yo. It's all your fault, yo. Mudsdale, shall we stomp these scoundrels? There'll be a mess to clean up afterwards, and I'm willing if you are. Time for us to break out, yo! Gotta tell y'all peace out, yo! I'm not gonna keep telling you this, except when I keep telling you this, you better listen to what my homie says and drill into that thick skull of yours. Seriously, you better not forget, numbskull. You'll be fine getting home? Glad to see that Driftmoon will get home on her own. I've got, uh, you to thank for that. Give me your name, trainer. Hold on, eh? That's a fine name. I like the way you handle yourself in battle. But Sarah and I are always wandering around about Alola to try to achieve our goals, so perhaps we'll meet again someday. I'm indebted to you for a for your aid, after all. Ah, yes, you might want to try your hand at Battle Royale or two. Azdell here thinks you'll be well suited to it, given how strong you are. Oh, hi. Of course, fucking... I, I wanted to look to see if we were really close. Like, doesn't this make a shortcut back to the town? But I can't see, because Rotom doesn't shut the fuck up. Cubone! Hello! 
I was gonna say, it's it's not an Alolan Cubone, but Cubone... It's Marowak that has the Alolan form, not Cubone. Uh, Dragon Rage, we'll see how much it does. Alright. Get Eden to level 26. Sand Tomb. Finish the job. There we go. Yeah, level 26. Okay, can I have my bottom screen? No, you're still talking about the same thing. Thank you. Okay. I... I don't want to talk to you. Give me the... Give me the map, you... Oh! Whatever. Hey, rare candy. Gotta use it immediately. Because I won't remember it's there. Uh, there we go. Uh, we'll give it to... Sepia Top. Carbos, okay. I don't get the point of why that was... Alright, whatever. And yes, it does go back down here. Okay. Solid. Solid. Come over here. We... Oh, there's a sticker too. Oh, but can't get up, up and close to it. On Tauros. It's number 23. Oh! Number 24. There's an item back here. We got a big mushroom. Alright. Hollow Island. Yeah, yeah. You can go to the Diglett Cave as well now. I don't remember what that building is. Where was... There. It was like, there was a sticker we could see, but we couldn't touch. What is this building? There's something to do with the surf. Oh, this is... Oh, I know what this building is. Okay, I'm not gonna... Just in case. I mean... Plenty of people have... Well, let me at least talk to them. I didn't mean to leave. This building gives you a specific thing. Uh... Let's see. I believe a Mantine Surfer. Yeah, yeah, You gotta... You gotta talk to him after you... The first place... Scores on all of the Mantine Surfs. Okay, what is this building? Speaking span, yeah. Okay. Isn't this where the Game Freak building is? Or Game Freak room, rather? Shiny Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, cause there's the Game Freak sign right there. Oh, there's a sticker. I'm taking that sticker off your computer. We get anything else here? Let's see. Very cute. Uh, I'm the game director. Rotom Dex is fun. No, no, the Rotom Dex sucks. Please remove it. Give it a mute button. Uh, if you're making games here, what color would you choose? Uh, I forgot about this. This is really yeah. Uh, red. Interesting. I'd say you're probably the type who stays true to your heart and says what you want. Sure. And then, yeah, you get... If you fill your decks, you go talk to him. And then we got... A lemonade. Shine kill. Alright. So... <laughs> there's the Game Freak building. And if we go up further, isn't it something to do with the Aether Paradise? Or Aether Foundation? Yeah. Another sticker in here, though. I don't know if we can go in here. Oh, we can go in here. Okay. Hello. I don't remember if this room has any, you know, cooped up in a box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. Do you want me to look? Thank you so much. Please take this Pokeball. Huh? Left? Poke... Wait. What did you say? Key item? I wonder if something is the relationship between Pokemon and Trainer. What did you say? A trainer who passed away. We know that he was from Ululu Island. I hope you can find something. Huh. 
We got a left Pokeball. I didn't think she was going to say anything important. <laughs> a Pokeball with a, uh, with a Pokemon that lost its trainer inside. Seems to be... Wait, lost its trainer inside. Oh, oh, okay. The, the Pokeball is in the Pokeball. The trainer is dead. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Whenever we get to Ula Ula, which... That's island number three, I believe. Yeah, because Pawnee is number four. Okay. Well, glad I uh, decided to check in over here. On top of just getting more totem stickers. That's always that's always a plus. Um, I mean, we have to go into that building story-wise, so I'll just save it for that. I guess let's go ahead and get Join Avenue or Whatever this is called, completed. There's a Pokemon Center here, anyways. We're being stopped, aren't we? A Royal Avenue. Join Avenue, that's that's a thing from black and white, isn't it? Alright, I was like, can I... Please. <laughs> Please. The game pots us so much. Uh, I don't know if we actually need healed or not, but might as well while we're here. This will get more. Was it pollen or whatever it changes Oricorio's form over here? Why are you in the corner? Do you want my Barboach? It did a great job at uh, Wello Volcano. I don't mind trading it for a Tentacool. No. <laughs> Alright. Fucking a champ and a little kid. Thrifty Mart. Alright, come over here. Yeah, there we go. Nectar, not pollen. That's what it is. Any stickers hidden around here? Yes, yes, there are. Got some more nectar. What was that? Huh? I heard that earlier. We passed something. Oh. Hi. I don't care about taking pictures, but I just wanted to know what, what it was. Fishing rod. Yeah. Malasada shop. We got a little well. Oh. Still the cold water. Yeah? What is... Interesting that it's interactable for some reason? What is this? Pokemon Fan Club! Okay. <laughs> Look at the Meowth picture! You know, I do! That's right! Are you gonna give me one? Thanks! Oh wait, no, you're not. He was just telling me it's use. Never mind. Welcome to the Pokemon Fan Club. This is where people around the world gather to show off their photos of their most beloved Pokemon. My favorite has got to be the lovely Meowth to my left. I am not surprised, considering what's behind you. It's so cute and lovely and smart, it's almost too much to take. Oh, sorry, once I start bragging, oh, how the time does get away from me. Uh, no, I, as I was saying, are you taking photos of your favorite Pokemon for him? Or, wait, what? I completely read that wrong. Uh, the more photos you take your Pokemon, the, the more affectionate they become towards you. In fact, I can see how affectionate your Pokemon are feeling towards you. Mm -hmm. uh, but your Pokemon could still be more affectionate towards you than it is now. Become true friends. Okay, so if we max... Wait, max happiness. Or no, affection. Yeah. I don't want to do that. Because it makes them on, like, broken. The max affection. Malasada shop. Uh, I'll pass. All right. Why do I do this? Every time someone brings me down, I end up coming right back here. Come on, Noel, we'll beat everyone who stands before us. We're gonna be strong enough to protect them this time. Okay, so we're gonna do this, and whoever dies in it, because believe me, I'm gonna get blown back. Whoever dies in it is not actually dead because it's a battle royale and not an actual real battle. Uh, sticker. 
All right. His music though. Ah, I thought I saw something up there. 30 sti uh, totem stickers. Okay. So I guess 40 would be the next one. I was I, I thought maybe we'd get a call from Samson. All right. Oh yeah, glad you could make it, brother. I'm here today, yeah, to spread the word, oh yeah, about Battle Royale. They call me the Master Royal. Woo! Huh? The Master Royal! <laughs> I'm here to teach you, oh yeah, about the battle format passed down in Alola for generations. The battle, the Pokemon Battle Royal, woo! But Royal, what's the Battle Royale, you might ask? Woo! Four trainers! Four trainers, yeah, each one. Uh, pick three Pokemon, yeah, for one big Pokemon battle, oh yeah. When one, one, tra one trainer's team can't battle anymore, the cream rises to the top. The battle royale ends. Whichever trainer has taken out the most Pokemon, yeah, and the most Pokemon left will emerge the winner, woo. <laughs> First, just give it a shot, pick your Pokemon, and let's do this. Dude, it's the Mast Royal. I want to battle, I want to battle. You there, come come join in the fun. Oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'll be in the mix too, yeah. And now we'll have a foursome. Woo! Alright. Calm down. What? Gladion too? Discovery! New experience! Ooh! Adventure! It's all yours if you want it! It's time for a Pokemon Battle Royal! Ready? Fight! Oh, uh, this is the best part about this. This is the Master Royal. Alright, Battle Royale time. In the Battle Royale Dome, the arena for the Battle Royales. The dome is packed and filled with excitement. I didn't get to pick them on. I mean, like I said, it doesn't matter. They're not gonna they're not gonna be considered dead. Uh Eden. Oh, okay. It's just whoever is up front. Dartrix. Okay, hey, Rock Rough. And type no. In before, I get triple teamed. The Battle Royale starts now. Alright. Look at that lag. Oh my. Uh, they're all level 20 except for me. I am going to dual chop type no. Fastest thing here, too. All right, one hitting me. Okay, I'm not getting triple teamed. Raise leaf. Oh yeah, it hits everyone. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um. Well, if we're the fastest thing here, I'm gonna go ahead and take the rock rough kill. Tackle another razor leaf. Well, oh, it's, oh yeah, yeah, that's how Battle Royales were, yeah, that's why we stopped doing them and went back to just normal as free-for-alls. Ooh, yes, what do you think? It's easy to have a fun time with Battle Royale, ooh! And even with a shot at, at beating real tough opponents this way, yeah! Um, I don't know what name to give, or what name, what voice to give him. You run fire during that battle, I hope you bring that fire with you and burn up my trial. Hello. The name's Kiawe, the fire captain. You can get to Whale of Volcano from Route 7. I'll be waiting on the peak. If you plan to see your island challenge through to the end, climb to the top with your strongest team. Ooh, so, Polu, how? How are your trials going? I hope you and your Pokemon are working hard and having a blast, woo! But Mr. Mass Royal, I don't even know that we're doing our trials right now. Oh, I get it because of our amulets, huh? Well, I'm having a blast. But why are you e here. Why would you even want to do a battle royal? You still trying to get stronger or something? Maybe you just want to make some friends. Heh. <laughs> I'm not here to play. I'm here because you can't protect anything when you're weak. Wow, you're just a ray of sunshine, huh? 
I think you have a lot more fun if you just let yourself have a good time with everyone else. You can do a lot more together, too. Well, I don't know what his deal is, but I thought the battle was just plain fun. And so I'm gonna keep doing battle royals. And my Pokemon seem to like him, too. All right. Well, I think we're gonna save the Eevee for next episode. Uh, because we're gonna get our Route 7 encounter and the Volcano encounter as well. So might as well just do all three in one big glob. But that's gonna do it for me today. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I will see you all next time.